I want this to be one of the craziest top water days ever. And to do that, we have to have a crazy top water bait. Oh, dude, he just slurped it. I saw him go up and slurp it. That was sick. Oh, there's a bunch back here. Oh, oh there's one, there's one, there's one. Oh. Oh, there's one. There's one. Got him. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we were out here super early. It is literally, I think, 30 minutes before sunrise. And we were out here because today is top water time. It's been a long time since I've thrown top water specifically out here. And I've been waiting to do this because I just want it to be as heated up as possible. I want this to be one of the craziest top water days ever. And to do that, we have to have a crazy top water bait. Right here, some of you guys may know what this is because I have done two of these on the channel. I feel like this is gonna be a yearly thing where I just order a crazy frog and fish with it. But as you guys can tell, this thing is glowing. This is a $30 Japanese frog. So this is a JDM product. And uh, this thing is super crazy. I've fished with these in the past and these are honestly, I can say one of my favorite frogs ever. And uh, this one actually came with some English on the back so I can actually tell you guys why it works so well. But today we're gonna be fishing with this $30 frog. And uh, this is honestly one of the most expensive frogs I've ever seen. So it's gonna be really fun to see how this thing goes today and see if the fish are biting. Uh, as you guys can tell, it's still pretty dark and uh, it's kind of cloudy. I don't think it was supposed to be cloudy. But anyways, we're still gonna get it done. We're still gonna catch some fish. But as you guys can tell, this thing is super crazy. It has a glowing effect on it first off, and then it has a skeleton look to it. So this thing is actually a really cool frog because it, I was gonna read the color, but it doesn't even say it. It's in Japanese, okay. But this thing is so cool. I'm ready to open this thing up and get out there and actually catch some fish on it. But I'm super excited. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button for me. But let's go ahead, let's open up this frog, check it out and tie it on. Well, all right, right here we have our top water frog. I'm not sure if you guys can tell, but this thing actually does glow and it glows. Like this thing, I don't think it ever runs out of charge. I don't know what kind of material it is, but it's, it glows 24 seven. It's been sitting in my room and it's just been glowing like crazy. But anyways, this is an Akashi brand frog, $30 from Japan. It actually has the price back. It's actually 25, but then you gotta pay taxes because it's shipping from Japan, you know, shipping and taxes, all that. Yeah, we're not gonna talk about that. But anyways, uh, this thing is super cool. And this one, out of all four that I have, this one actually came with an English description printed on the back. So it says, that it has an unusual big head for normal hollow frogs. Me and this frog have something in common. I've been told I've had a big head. But anyways, um, this one says that there's a skating action not available with other frogs. Which then again, at the bottom it says enjoy this action with a period. It says it also has excellent hooking. Whoever wrote this description was just, I don't know. But this is a cool frog and I'm super excited to throw this today. You guys know if you've seen the videos in the past with these things, these things catch fish. And not only fish, they catch big fish. But then again, last time I broke the last one. Right here, it's just a split in the head. I don't think that's supposed to be there. Basically that just popped right down the middle homie's done for and we caught one fish on it so we're gonna hope this one survives multiple let's go ahead let's tie it up and let's go catch them
All right, we're currently moving to the first spot. I'm excited. As you can tell, my excitement is leaking out. I've been up since five o'clock, but it's all good. Once I get a few blow ups in me, you don't even need caffeine. Top order blow ups just wake you up. So uh, we're, we're cruising to the first spot. Kind of overcast. I think it's supposed to get sunny later on, but right now we're rocking with a little bit of wind, overcast and a skeleton frog that glows in the dark. I'm feeling good. Let's go ahead, let's crank them. All right, well here we go. $30 Japanese glow in the dark skeleton frog. All those words coming out of my mouth were kind of overwhelming and kind of crazy now that I think about it. But anyways, we're gonna throw this thing and hopefully catch a monster bass today. Fish look pretty active, so we're gonna hope for the best. And this thing does not lie when it says it has an amazing glide. This thing has one of the best glides I've ever thrown. That's why this is one of my favorite frogs ever. But this thing is gonna just get absolutely crushed today. I mean, look at that thing. Jeez, could you imagine throwing this thing at night whenever the visibility on the top of the glowing frog is glowing? That'd be crazy. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda hope we get a top water bite today kind of not the conditions I was expecting, but it could be really good if it all lines up good enough. I'm thinking, oh, oh, there's a fish in, oh, I just got hit, I just got hit, I just got hit. Oh, it's about to get crazy. Oh, it's about to get nuts. Oh, it's about to get wild out here. I just saw a fish moving the brush over there. Things are about to get out of hand quick. It's about to be crazy. Come on. Dude, the skating action on it is so good. Dude, I mean, I hate to be that guy, but the old saying, you get what you pay for, definitely stands true with this thing. This is so sick. Dude, I love this frog. That's why I bought three of them. Technically four, but I've only thrown three. Here's where it goes down. Oh, frick. I already caught a tree. And what would top water fishing be if I didn't hook a tree in the first five minutes? It looks crazy, man. There's a little face on this thing as it's walking. You're gonna tell me we get a blow up like instantly and then it's all just gonna die off. That's so whack. Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh. He was little, bro. His whole body came out of the water for it. He almost killed me. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, there's one. There's one. There's one. Let's go. That was sick. Get up here, little buddy. Welcome to the boat. Oh, dude, that's a nice one. Look at our little skeleton frog on the top over here doing his thing. That's what I'm talking about, man. Look at that perfect hook set right there. Got both of them in. I love how this frog has this ejectable hook system. What a stud. First fish. First one on the $30 frog. Thank you, buddy. Such a nice fish. He's been looking like he's been doing a little bit of spawning action. Bloody tail. But now he's eating $30 Japanese frogs. I respect it. See you, buddy. I appreciate you. Woohoohoo. They're fired up this morning. I'm awake now. It's time to put the hammer down on some fish. As long as our frog is not broken. It's not? All right, good. That's a good sign. I remember the first time I threw this thing, whenever the uh, hook's ejected like that, dude, I, it took me like 15 minutes to put it back together. I love this frog. So, ow! I hate this frog. Just stab me. Jeez, I was trying to, I'm supposed to pull this little knot through, but dude, it's in there. Frog's back in business. Time to catch eight pounders. Bad thing is I've only had two bites. I need more. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. Let's see how it is. Be like that. Oh, oh, oh. Oh! Dude, he just slurped it. I saw him go up and slurp it. That was sick. That's a decent fish right there. That was so cool. Oh, that was so cool. Oh, we're gonna have to net that boy. We're gonna have to net him. 
get up in here. Thank you. Oh, that was sick. Something about waking up early in the morning just really gets you going up in here. Some topwater blow ups, getting bites left and right. Look at how he ate it. <laughs> Don't do it again. Okay. Look at how he ate this thing. He just came up and slurped it. I saw a little weight coming up and I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Boom. What a beauty. Thanks, buddy. Something about just top water fishing in the morning. You can't beat it. Especially when you're throwing a frog that's getting absolutely munched. That's a nice fish. Number two on the board for us. Let's get him back. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate you. You came up, slurped the old skeleton frog. And he's on his way. Oh, that's disgusting. Look at that water clarity. Yes. Let's go. Two fish. I'm feeling good. This just looks like a playground right now. Look at all the spots we can cast. I'm way back in there. I don't even see my frog. Then again, back here is either, <laughs> something just like right there. Back here is hit or miss. There's either fish back here or there's not. Oh, that was sick. He hit it as soon as it hit the water. Oh, he spit it. That was like a one and a half pounder. Dude, as soon as it hit the water, boom, on it. That was so cool. Oh, dang. This thing had a ton of water in it. The fish like these things. That is for sure. We're just, we're out here. This is what I love. I love being out in the middle of nowhere. The bird interrupted me. I like being in the middle of nowhere with a frog. And some braid. And then I like to put the hammer down on some fish. And that is, is what we've done so far. I'm just waiting for the big girl that's waiting right over there for me to throw this frog right in her face so she can eat it into a million pieces. It's been a long time since I caught a big fish, so hopefully today everything goes my way and we catch a 10. We're skipping the seven, the eight, the nine. We're going straight to the 10. Just gotta get one to bite. I think that's kind of a possibility too. What is that noise, dude? Oh, 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 something just saw it moving. Oh. Is that a dog? That was the biggest slurp I've ever seen in my life. That's a big fish back there. Good thing is, it didn't get a hook. I'm going back in for round two. And we're going more aggressive. You can't slurp it. You don't have to eat it. You're gonna have to hit it hard. You're gonna have to crush it if you want it. Don't think he wants it as bad as he wants it. That fish just didn't have it all the way. I've noticed a bunch of them are slurping it. They're not really popping it as hard as I want them to. We're not getting the blow up that I'm wanting. I want the blow up that looks like it just like exploded into a million pieces, you know? Like I want all of the particles in the water to shoot up like that and then i want to just hear it echo in the forest yep all right here we go ah, call my shot real quick top water blow up right there here we go that looks so good i can't contain myself oh my that was a monster. That was a monster. How did he miss it? That was a, that was an eight pounder, 100%. I saw the whole body come out of the water. No way he eats it again. No way he eats it again. He almost took the rod out of my hand. That's the type of blow up I'm talking about. Except I would like to hook the fish too. I think I forgot to mention that part. Oh, 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 everything hurts. 
my heart is jumping out of my chest. That was a monster. He's not going to eat again. 100%. He's not going to eat again. I dare him to eat again. Eat again. I dare you. I dare you. You, can, you won't do it. He's not going to do it. Oh, dude, I'm heartbroken. I even saw him, too. I got too excited. I should have let him take it. The way he ate it, I was for sure he had it. I mean, he, he literally bodied my frog. He came out of the water, jumped on top of it, put it in his mouth, and then spit it out when I set the hook. It was crazy. I may never recover from that. It's because my hands were slippery. You know, you, whenever you're sitting there moving it, you know, your the water droplets gets on your hands, and yeah, yeah, that's what happened. I don't, I don't want to be that guy that makes excuses, but that's what happened. Guys, what is there not to bite about this thing? It has a big head, it's moving side to side. It's literally the perfect frog you've ever seen in your life and it glows in the dark. What more could you want? What more could you want? Lost all my confidence in the spot after I missed the big one. Leave it to me. There's so much junk on the water over here that's hard to actually walk this frog. Oh! That scared me. I might be, oh, I'm okay. Oh my gosh. That was not the one that ate, but I will take it. I need a second. My whole body's like tingling. It's top water blow ups, man. I've missed them. Oh, dude, that was sick. Ow. There we go. Ooh, I just barely got him. I love frog fishing. I'm okay. It's just going to take me a second to relax a little bit. Look at that fish. He hit it so hard and aggressive. That was actually crazy. And he's back here in like three foot of water, which is actually wild. Thanks, little buddy. You're not the big guy that I saw that almost pulled the rod out of my hand. But we will take you. Well, it's official. They're back up in this junk. See you, buddy. It's just been a massacre. I don't know how many we've caught, but it's going good, except the fact that I lost that big one. Oh, there's a spider on my... Yeah, that's right. You want to mess with me? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's right. Oh, he's still alive. Oh, my God, no way. <laughs> Got him. He's crawling in the, the boat carpet now. Dead. Okay, that was a little aggressive. I'm about to make one more cast back here, and then I'm calling it, because, like... He came back, got a few blow ups, missed the big one. Cause why wouldn't I? You know. Plus there's a little bit of wind on this main. The little like, oh, there's one. I was like not even paying attention. Get over here, little buddy. <laughs> Look at the skeleton. Oh, he got off. Okay, that's cool. You freak up my frog and then you get off. I don't know if they're big or not. I would assume probably not. Oh my gosh. There we go. There we go. That was sick. Oh, I didn't lay into him because I didn't know if he had it. <laughs> I was going to set the hook, but I didn't want it flying back at my face. So I just kind of like laid back. <laughs> it's about to get good. There's one. Got him. He came airborne. There's one. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. We out here, we out here, we're here. I told you guys we weren't gonna miss any more fish. We ain't starting with this little guy. Thanks, man. Should've shook him. <laughs> Should've shook him. There's a big one back there. Always big, always back there. He's big and he's back there. Here we go, here we go, right on top of his head. Oh, there's a bunch back here. Oh, dude, that was sick. That was so sick. Oh my gosh, there's still more. 
dude, I saw him come up. His face came out, but that tree was in the way. Stupid tree, dude. Messed me all up. Oh, there's one. Oh, oh, that was sick. That was so sick. Get up here, buddy. This is the second one that was with him. Jeez, he was going airborne. I net this guy. He's pretty good. Oh, ho, ho, ho. he swerved me. Oh, ho, ho. dude, he choked this frog. Come here, buddy. How am I so bad with the net? Oh my God, I'm so bad with the net. Okay, we're good. That's what I'm talking about. Look it up. Sheesh. Oh, I got him so good. Top of the lips, everything. Look at that. Guys, and literally, this is a warm fish. Super shallow, as you can tell. It's real shallow back here. And that's where he's just chasing bait. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate you. So much fun. Such, such clearer. It's way more clear over here, too. Oh, my gosh. Fired up this morning, huh? <laughs> so much fun. Let's see if I can get this buddy that I missed. Well, all right. We just got off of the boat. We used our Japanese frog today. This thing killed it. We caught a ton of fish. It was a really good top order day. I'm still kind of bummed that I missed that big one. It's going to haunt my dreams tonight and tomorrow and the next day and the next day, probably for the next week, but it's all good. We, we still caught a ton of fish. We still got a lot of use out of this thing. It is currently falling apart. There's a split in the back of the head. This thing is uh, it's taking a beating today. It's missing paint. It's scratched up. It's, it's pretty much destroyed which means it was a good day. But $30 for this thing, and you get about a day of some solid fishing, is kinda eh, but you know, it does walk really good, it does attract the fish, and we did get a ton of blowups, and it was a lot of fun. So, 100% worth it in my opinion, especially just because how these things look, they're so cool and unique. But it was a lot of fun. If you guys have any video ideas for this summer, whether it be top water or certain lures or like a camping slash survival challenge, let me know down below in the comment section. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button for me. And I'll see you guys in the next one.